I yield back. Thank you. Gentlelady yields back, Chair. Thanks, the gentlelady. The gentlelady from Minnesota is recognized for questions. Thank you, Mr. Chair. And um, I also am interested in the rule of law. And I have uh, just uh, Chairman Comer, was the subpoena duly issued? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Did Attorney General Garland ignore that? Or? Yes. So that's what we're talking about today. Yes, that's, ma'am. That should be our laser focus. That's why I'm here. And I appreciate that. Yeah. Um, because, uh, because I think if you're tuning in for bits and pieces of this, you, you, you miss the whole point that we have one thing in front of us. And, um, and I, I will tell you, I, I was um, interested when Mr. McGovern, when I came in and Mr. McGovern said this is a waste of time, but I remember sitting on that side of the, um, of the desk and uh, I, three or four times we had, uh, we had rules like this holding someone in contempt. And uh, so I appreciate... Uh, I wasn't going to, I was not going to ask any more questions. I just wanted to make a statement. But can, I, can I comment? Certainly. Thank you. Uh, the president has exerted executive privilege in this case. And the proper means is to contest the validity of the executive privilege in court, not to pursue a contempt against the attorney general or anyone else. When executive privilege is asserted, it may be valid, it may not, that's up to a court. Well, I, I find this incredibly just ridiculous because they have the transcript. All they are asking for is the videotape and you're defending somehow that this videotape is then protected by executive privilege. That's a it seems ridiculous. That's an interesting argument for the court. Okay, but it seems ridiculous that this is, we are at a point here where uh, where we the that the videotape is not just released and we have the we have the transcript and 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 surprising that it didn't come together that they weren't uh, you know in many cases but I just uh, I just wanted to make the statement that we need to focus on what we are talking about here so that the American people understand and I know there's lots of talking points and there's all kinds of things the American people need to understand this is about a duly issued subpoena that was ignored, and that is what we are talking about Excuse today. Me, it was with not that, ignored. I yield back. It's executive privilege was asserted. It was compliant. And I yield back. Sure. Thanks, the gentlelady. Gentlelady yields back. The gentleman from South Carolina is recognized. 